Hello YouTube, Robert Alvarez, the Psychic Witch, also known as Mr. Lighting and a Fan, and yes, I have my lighting, and I have my fan. A little nippy outside, but I still got my fan. So here we are, the very last card in the Pride Tarot, a collaborative deck, published by U.S. Game Systems in April 2020, meaning that it, will have been pub it was published four years ago next month. And it is The King of Pentacles by Helena Nelson Reed. I went through the deck twice, and I did not see her name. Although, for some reason, her name sounds familiar. And I think I know why. I think it is because of the fact that the King of Pentacles represents me as a sun sign Capricorn. So, with that being said, I am now going to read... The King of Pentacles, illustrated by Helen and Nelson Reed. And I love what Helen and Nelson Reed wrote about this. It actually has two sections, the interpretation and uh, in Helen and Nelson Reed's own words. So, again, King of Pentacles by Helena Nelson Reed. The King of Pentacles represents ambition, success, generosity, loyalty, and precision. This king enjoys luxury, but even more, he likes having a full treasury and solid investments. Associated with the earth sign Taurus, for some people it's the fixed signs, for me it's the cardinal signs, he is analytical, stubborn, and methodical. A true royal, he possesses full confidence in himself. The faraway castle shows that the king likes a safe emotional distance from others. Yeah, that's very Taurus, but it's also kind of Capricorn too. And protects what is his. Golden coins signifying wealth tumble into flowing waves. Water symbolizes transformation, nourishment, purification, and life's ephemeral nature. What a beautiful description. And now, also in Helen, Helena Nelson Reed's own words, I've worked in imagery from LGBTQ plus history, as well as some personal symbols. Oh, I'm reading it a little bit differently. I'm reading it incorrectly, so let me try that again. I, meaning Helena Nelson Reed, I've worked in imagery from both LGBTQ plus history, as well as some personal symbols. The rainbow at the center of the pentacle represents, oh no, I'm sorry, the rainbow at the center of the pentacle over the king's heart honors two gay family members and my gay friends, past and present. The black and white delineated checks in the king's robe represent rigid societal structure. As the robe drifts in the winds of change, the squares morph into a free-form pattern of organic shapes and a luxurious and a luxuriant tangle of greenery and grapes. Wow. I I see I I I I really love the backstory um, with all of these cards and the illustrations. I really, really do. And here is the bio of Helena Nelson Reed. Helena Nelson Reed is a visionary artist whose primary medium is watercolor. Born in Washington State, she was raised in Marin County and Napa Valley, California, and today lives in Illinois. Nelson Reed's primary focus is exploring the collective consciousness and the portrayal of archetypal imagery in the tradition of Carl Gustav Jung and Joseph Campbell. Rendered in, in luminous watercolor technique, Nelson Reed's paintings are created in extraordinary detail indeed, pushing the medium of watercolor past the usual limits. Helena created the artwork for the Sacred Earth Oracle and is currently working on a tarot deck. 
There is a website address for Helen and Nelson Reed, which I will happily include in the description box for this video. I am so very beyond thankful to U.S. Game Systems Incorporated for publishing a tarot deck that honors the enormously vast contributions and legacies of the LGBTQIA+, IA2S+, community, a community of which I form part, as well as being most thankful to Helen and Nelson Reed for illustrating the King of Pentacles. And of course, I especially want to thank all of you in YouTube land for not only honoring who I am and what I do, not only for all the likes, comments, shares, subscriptions to my YouTube channel, and of course, an extra big and beautiful thank you to those of you who have already scheduled your sessions, but I especially want to thank all of you in YouTube land for your enormous patience in this particular more than a walkthrough series of videos. I honestly did not believe that it would take this long. I really didn't. And it, it most certainly was neither my intention nor my desire to take this long to complete this more than a walkthrough series of videos. However, as some of you know all too well, when I am getting ready for an event, um, especially the upcoming Moon, Serpent, and Bone 6th Annual Ostara Night Market, everything gets put on the back burner. YouTube videos, WordPress blog posts, social media posts that have nothing to do with an upcoming event, all of that gets pushed way to the back burner. And now I'm dealing with some personal issues that I've needed to deal with since last December. So that's even more pushed a lot of things on the back burner. But I am happy to say that things are slowly but steadily improving in these personal issues. And my intention is to get back on track with both YouTube videos and with um, living in a city with WordPress blog posts. So to all of you in YouTube land, an extra big and beautiful and bountiful and beauteous thank you for all the likes, all the comments, all the shares, all the subscriptions to my YouTube channel, all of you who have already scheduled your sessions, including the amazingly magical individual who had a 90-minute video reading with me last night. And of course, as always, stay in tune with your intuition. Stay safe. COVID-19 is still a real thing. Stay well. Stay hydrated. Alternate your tea with coffee and water. And stay tuned for the next video.